Hello, you've reached Johan Vermeule with MobilityMinded.com and today we're going to take a quick look at the Navigon USA application. It's a navigation application that's very familiar already for people using the Android devices and using the iPhone. However, right now, as you can see, it's available for Windows Phone 7.5. So you need Windows Phone 7.5 or the Mango updates for most people know it as well to be able to run this navigation system. So we're getting a small warning that is, of course, collecting some data from you uh, to be able to navigate. As you can see, a beautiful, nice screen, home screen. You can slide over, search for point of interest, then show map, GPS, POI settings, and we're back at the destination. So a nice one is to take me home, of course. Here we go. It tells you where you are. Here's my navigation little arrow. Hopefully you guys can see it, there we go. It shows you on the map with the point of interest instantly. So you really know, hit start and it will start navigating. As you can see, it already knows I'm here. So and that is not gonna show you too much. How, now, how does this work? If you enter a new address and we're gonna find something, for example, in New Haven uh, or New Britain, it doesn't matter. We'll type in a, st type in a street and you type in a number, you tap on that, then you get to see the map, what you typed into, and you can have a couple options. Either you have cancel, save, what kind of a uh, profile do you want for navigating, and to start navigating. However, you can also pin this to your start, send this as a text message, or send it as an email. So there's a lot of quick options to be able to do this. We go hit the back button that's the only thing you can't hit to cancel there we go if i hit the cancel right here and um we are back to the home screen so my destinations those are the recent destinations your favorites and your recents so we're going to go back here your contacts so it's looking into your contacts of your phone of people that you want to navigate to however I have noticed that each time in the startup of this context, it takes a very long time to actually pull in all your contacts before you are able to search a contact in your address book. So um, small delay on that one. Uh, not not a biggie yet for me, uh, but uh, I hope that Navigon will improve on that. As you can see right now, I have all my contacts right here and now I can do a search on this. So very great. On the bottom, we have the settings. Okay, you can use language, you can change your voices, you can change your miles. It's text to speech. So right now I got Lynn, which is the, uh, the text to speech. I have it in miles, day, night, and uh, day and night mode is automatically. So it runs on the, on the GPS clock. So you will know, uh, the application would know when to switch your, your screen, your dimming of your screen and the coloration of the screen. Uh, let me go. What else do we have here? We have my routes are on, uh, 3D navigation, tree map streets on, etc. So red light camera, I guess I would like to have those. We'll do that. Oh, let's go back to settings. And traffic on request. You can put it on automatic so you get your traffic information as well. Optimize, you're sending the floating car data to Navigon for anonymity. Uh, that way they actually could see if you are in a traffic jam and have a better uh, understanding of uh, or giving information back to all Navigon users about traffic. So very good. So let's, let's go for uh, a destination that I have. So let's say start and let's see what it will do. As you can see, it's giving me a nice route, different ways of driving it. I'll have uh, a couple options on the bottom. You can see that right here. It is the my route or the demo. Let's do that. Let's run the demo. So shortest route, uh, fastest route and the my route. So let me make sure my volume is up. Turn right onto North Colony Street. 
There you go. On the bottom we have a couple of options. Could be the volume, the settings, the profile and the traffic, GPS info or if you want to go to a, a, a point of interest on your route. The other thing that you saw is that you could also uh, block out certain roads at the same time. Tapping on miles the next directions. Turn right onto North Colony Street. So tapping on the bottom uh, box where it says the next turn will actually repeat in voice what you need to do. Tapping on the screen, let's see what else we have right here. We'll go to 2D. There's a quick switch. In 0.1 miles at the T-junction, turn right onto North Colony Street. In the 2D option, we have a couple other differences. My position, entire route, and set now turn right uh, destination. North Colony Street. So, here we go. Tap on the screen again. Please follow the road for two Full miles. Route. Just wondering how we can go back to the 3D view. You might have to hit the back button on that one. That's it. So the back button brings you back to the 3D view. On top, your speed, how many miles till the end, and what the possible, uh, what the anticipated arrival time is. So very good, very nice, very clean. Navigon USA uh, for $29.99, I believe, for the next couple of weeks. So get it when you can because the price will go up. Again, oh, one more thing I want to show you. The pin to the start is an option as well where you can say uh, one of your favorites can go right to your start. So I tap on the favorite. Uh, we'll start uh, launch the application. and it should pick it up right away for you. The warning is each time. There we go. And that's the one I want. I want a demo. And there we go. We're actually um, looking at the point of the demo where it was left off and it's driving back to my address. Volume off, volume on other settings, That's, those are the general settings we looked at before. Very nice. Coloration, I uh, have to say um, Navigon has a very nice um, coloration using in their navigation application where it is actually not uh, childlike colors, let me put it that way. Again, it's a must-have uh, for $30, have it on your phone. Um, once you have it, you have it. Now, All the updates off. will come on through on that. Street. So here we go. So this was Johan Vermeule with uh, MobilityMinder.com. And uh, we'll, uh, we'll talk later.